My name is Annie. Um, I'm a musical theatre performer. Um, and today we're going to be doing a little bit of a masterclass uh, from the musical Hairspray. So um, first of all, I'll start to talk a little bit about who I am and what I've done. Um, so I grew up um, in Seam, which is a little town down the road from Shields. Um, I grew up doing musical theatre, going to all of the Amdram societies I possibly could, um, taking singing lessons and dance lessons. Um, so every night I was doing something. Um, I always used to do some schools and stuff, um, which is how I kind of really started to want to do this as a career. So um, I started doing some schools uh, with a youth project called um, YMT, which is the Youth Music Theatre. Um, now, this company is amazing. They run um, workshops all through the summer across different places in the country. And um, when I started doing these, uh, it was really when I was like, I want to do this with my life. So I kind of knew from quite early on, maybe about 12 or 13, um, we used to love doing stuff like that. Um, before that, I uh, used to go to Stagecoach and um, I would be the kids in the touring shows that came to the Summer Empire and the Theatre Royal and local theatres like that. So I was super lucky when I was little, um, I got to do shows such as Scrooge when that was touring. Um, was in Joseph quite a few times and um, loads of shows like that there they have loads of kids in. So from quite an early age, I was very much in the theatre world and um, aspiring to be like these older performers um which is weird because now when i'm lit when i was little now i'm in i've been in shows where i've been with the same people uh, who were in them shows when i was little so that was a bit weird for us when i first started doing it um but yeah um i was doing when i was up north i was just putting my heart and soul into everything that i could do uh, when i was up here and then um through ymt they were offering a scholarship for uh, a school in uh, london and I said to my mom, I was, please, 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 can I go and audition for this school? And she said, uh, she was like, you can go to the audition for experience, um, but then you can't go because you can't afford it. And I was like, okay. So we went down to the audition um, and, and I got in. Um, and then luckily <laughs> uh, everyone pitched together and managed to get me down there. So I went to a school called PPA, which is Performance Preparation Academy. And I did my A-levels there, so two year course um a level equivalent to get into universities um and it was in audition preparation and i just had the best time and i would not have got in the drama school if i hadn't have gone to this drama school first so i was super lucky had the best two years in guildford um, and then i started auditioning and i was so lucky and forever will think i'm this lucky for getting into um to art ed uh, which is a musical theater school in london and I'd wanted to go to art ed since I was like uh, 11 years old. It was just something in my head. I was like, I'm going to go there. I'm going to go there. And um, so all my energy was just pushed into that. Um, so yeah, I, I got into art ed. And then that September, I went and trained uh, at drama school for three years in musical theatre. Um, it was the hardest three years of my life. Um, and I pay you a million pounds to go back. Um, in train again because it was it was unbelievable um so trained there for three i can't see because my hair um trained down there for three years um and then in my third year show um agents came to see us and i was super super lucky to sign with an agent um straight away um and we did bells are ringing which is a legit musical and we did a uh, year in town where i played a uh, hope cladwell um, I am more of an old school musical theatre performer. I love legit singing. Uh, I love opera. I love um, like old school dancing. I love tap. Um, so yeah, I kind of like steer towards the musicals if I can. Um, again, I was super lucky when I left drama school. Uh, I went straight into West Side Story and I understudied uh, Maria and played Rosalia. Uh, who sings America. So it's a really cool track because uh, you got to dance America uh, and sing it and then also dance like the mambo and dance the gym stuff, which was also really, really cool. Um, and then also got to sing legit, like, legit stuff as well. Um, 
so that job was was amazing for me and I was still kind of like learning how to do this craft a little bit so that was good so after West Side Story I then went into um a CBBC program so I started filming almost straight away for a CBBC show called Dixie and this is where I played uh, a 16 year old even though I was like 23 at the time <laughs> uh, played a 16 year old um, called Jane and um, it's a really cool show uh, it's all about blogging and YouTubing and stuff so it was good so if you have any under 10s go and check it out it's called Dixie uh, so yeah, after filming for, I'm just gonna like zoom through these now. <laughs> after filming for uh, CBBC, uh, I did some more, more jobs uh, in TV. Um, we did a Sky One pilot and I did, used to dance for Pinewood Studios. So all of the dancers in the background of films, uh, we used to go and do that. So I ended up ballroom dancing at one point, uh, which is something I'd never done before, but went and give it a whack. Um, so we did that uh, and then I went on tour with um, Verily Modern Millie, which is a tap show, um, which was absolutely fantastic. Uh, so I actually covered the character part in that uh, show because I'm a bit wacky. Um, so after we did that, uh, we then took it back out to Canada and then I took over the part as Miss Dorothy, um, who again is like the blonde bimbo who has like a legit voice and she taps and she's She's a funny character, so I absolutely loved playing her and enjoyed doing that loads. Um, so yeah, uh, since then I have, I've been to America on a few contracts, um, singing mainly, um, and we've opened up a fabulous musical theatre school, which is Musical Theatre Studio, MTS. Um, so that at the minute is based up north uh, in um, the Customs House, uh, South Shields. Uh, we do do workshops in other places as well. Um, so yeah, we currently run holiday workshops, um, in intensive training uh, in summer, Easter, October and February half terms. Um, so my energy has been going into that a lot recently um, and hopefully more exciting things coming very, very soon. And yeah, so that is kind of my journey into how I ended up getting into this crazy career of showbiz um and i can't wait to get auditioning for more shows and yeah to get cracking but if you are wanting to have a career in musical theater you just need to throw all of your energy at it and just not care about what people think of you and just do it because you whatever you love to do just just keep on doing it um with 120 percent of your being so yeah, that is me. Uh, what we're gonna do now, um, we're just gonna learn a few little, a few little bits and bobs from um, Hairspray in the Musical, which is is one of my favourites. Um, it's really, really energetic. It's really, really upbeat. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna split it up into three sections. Um, I'm just gonna do it once, and then if you need to redo it, um, which is a brilliant thing about video, you can press pause, go back, um, and get it, and keep practicing it until like till you get it. Um, once we've done the three sections, I'll do the whole thing with the music. Um, so it's to the song, The Nicest Kids in Town, and it's from the Broadway version of um, Hairspray, not the film. Um, so check it out. Uh, once you've learned the dance, please, please video them uh, and send them through to the customs house or to myself. I'll put my tags on here. Um, and yeah, I'd love to see what you guys are getting up to. Um, and if there's anything that you want to question me about or anything, please, please, please just drop me an email or a message. I am so open to talk to any aspiring young performers who, uh, who fancy doing this as a career. So yes, I will see you in a second for Hairspray. All right, guys, so we're going to start by doing two pony steps. So we'll just do the feet first. So we're going to jump onto the right leg and we go one, two, that's it. And after we've done that, we're going to put our hands here like a teapot and we're going to run around in a circle one time, really low to the ground. So that's after the two ponies. So we go pony, pony, hands here, run around, that's it. We're going to do a big jump, jump and down, that's it. So. All together, our hands are going to come like this. You can see my hands when we do our pony steps. So fists, really, really strong hands. 
So we go, pony, pony, turn around, jump and down. Good. We'll do it one more time and that's the end of the first section. Make sure when we do our ponies, our knees are really, really high. Are you ready? Five, six, seven, and pony, pony, turn around, jump and down. Good. We're going to do that whole thing three times. So we start this way, this way, turn around, up and down. We're going to jump onto this leg, this way, this way, turn around, jump and down. The third time, pony, pony, turn around, up and down. Good. So that's the first section. So I'll put the music on and you'll be able to see. Ready? Five, six, seven, and turn around, this way. Turn around, one more. Turn around. Well done. Fabulous. We're going to move on to section two now. So we've just gone, turn around, up and down for the third time. We're then going to run with our hands like this, really low to the ground. So we've gone, jump up and down, run, two, three, four. We're then going to put our hands fist again, five, six, over the top. And we're going to end like this, quite a fussy position. Yeah, let's do that again. So we go, run, two, three, four, here, here, over the top. Well done. Then from here, our knees are going to go to this side. That's it. Then to this side. Good. So our whole body is turning when we do this. So the move goes, we've gone round, round, over here. We go one, two, three. Lift your leg up with a flex foot. Let's do that again. So we've gone here, here, over the top. We go one, two, three, leg up four. That's it. We're going to do it again. Five, six, seven. This leg comes here. Eight. Good. Flex feet all the time. So let's go from this bit. You ready? And one, two, three, four, five, six, over the top. Good. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well done. It's a bit weird. <laughs> Good stuff. Let's add that on from the top. So, section one into section two. Ready? And pony, pony, turn around, up and down. Pony, pony, turn around, up and down. Pony, pony, turn around, up and down. One, two, three, four, five, six, over the top. Good. We go. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well done. So we've landed here. We're then going to do four claps. Up high in this corner, up high in this corner, down low, down low. Good. So that comes after this bit here. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Up, up, down, down. That's it. And then we're going to repeat that whole thing again. So from this bit here, the knees, we do the knee bit twice. So again, we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Clap, 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 clap. Good. So let's add that on from this bit here. You ready? Five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and two, three, and again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and two, three, four. Well done. We're going to go into section three now. Three. This is where Connie Collins says, take off your coats and leave the squares behind. So this goes, uh, we've just done our claps, two, three, four. Our hand's going to come here and across and take our coat off and the other side as well. 
That's it. So we go. Take off your coat and leave. Yeah? And we're going to walk forward. Take off your coat and leave. Good. The squares behind, we're going to make a big square. We're going to draw the TV, the TV screens that we're looking into. That's it. Take off your coat and leave the squares behind. Good. Then we're going to shout woo. Woo! We're going to throw it over our heads. That's it. And turn around. Good. Let's do that one more time. So we go. Take off your coat and leave the squares behind. Woo! Round back here. We're going to put our hands here. That's it, like a bird. Really, really, really old. This says, shake it, shake it, shake it, like we're losing our minds. Yeah? So we've just turned around. Hands come here. We're going to run on the spot. Shake it, shake it, shake it, like we're losing our minds. Our feet are going to go. Losing their minds. So one more time, make sure your ankles are really, really loose when you do it. Um, losing their minds. Good. Take off the coat and leave the squares behind. Woo! Shake it, shake it, shake it like they're losing their minds. Good. Last bit. This leg's free. We're going to tuck it round. Come on down to C and then a position of your choice with points. The nicest kids in town, yeah? If you can go on the splits, go on the splits. You can do a leg hold, do a leg hold. If you just want to pose like me, do that one. Good. So let's put it all together. So from the top, we go straight into the ponies. And pony, two, turn around, jump and down. Pony, two, Turn around, jump and down. Pony, two. Turn around, jump and down. One, two, three, four, five, six. Over the top, we go. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Collapse. Two, three, four. And again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Collapse. Two, three, four. Take off your coat and leave the squares behind. Woo! Shake it, shake it, shake it like we're losing our minds. Come on down to meet the nicest kids in town. Good. All right, guys, so we're going to do the whole thing with the music. Um, so don't worry if you didn't get any of them bits. Uh, just rewind back and go through them again. Um, and then I definitely want to see all of your videos. So this is what the whole thing looks like with the music. Ready? Five, six, seven, and... studios um, and any guy uh, we have classes on every week in ballet tap musical theatre um, and we also have interviews with uh, professional performers who are in the industry in TV on the West End to America um, in movies so if you want to come and check us out uh, please give us a follow and um, we'd love to see you guys soon Bye.